Hey guys, uh, yeah, it's, sorry, it's been a whole summer since I haven't posted, and, um, and, sorry, it's been like a whole, not much this year hasn't been posting lately, cause, you know, focus on main life and stuff like that, but, as I was walking across this channel, I decided to check out my first video of, the man in the middle and when I looked at the release date it's August 25th it was from August 25th 2021 as I look at the date right now it's August 25th 2024 so this channel is now reached the third anniversary for I that I opened this channel now since it was the third anniversary, for me thinking about something, I was planning on doing watching old videos, my reactions, but I think I'm ready to get this part of my chest out of of what what's a project I've been used to be doing, but not been doing anymore. I'm finally going to come out to say of why did I stop making scary stories to tell in the dark and gotcha like videos all right um i don't know how to to um i don't know how to bring this out honestly i've been wanting to make this video for quite a while but um i i don't really know how to before this but um I'm just gonna come out and say this. When I first opened this channel, I was 14 when I opened this channel. I was really into scary stories till the dark for like, since I was uh, like a kid, like I think I was like six or seven years old. Knowing those stories and the pictures just scared the living shit out of me. But real, but hell they were actually the first ever ch first chapter book i started reading as a kid but so when i wanted to do something about it i wanted to do like gotcha life forms knowing i was still into gotcha life during those times like my buddy friend sparkle unicorn i was really into her channel and we were like good friends for youtube for quite some time that I was like, well, since we're good friends, I might as well just do my own, my own gotcha life videos. And knowing I was still into like the creepypasta community back when it was the creepypasta community when Shadow was still around, I want I was part I was I was want to be part of that also. So, but instead of doing creepypastas, I just intend doing scary stories in the dark and gotcha life videos. Knowing, like, it was okay, like, from doing these, like, I would always making these from Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays, like, those were the schedule times, but, like, it was, like, coming out of the bus, going upstairs to the library, and I'll be going on and ten, and going on and ten making these videos to entertain y'all, but when I, so, after that, I did, theme park vlog videos when I first went to Halloween Horror Nights back in 2021 knowing that video was bad quality and then Animal Kingdom came along and I did that also so and knowing how much this channel is growing up now I'm really knowing like there's less or more viewers going on down to my older videos my gotcha life videos but now I'm I know I'm you're saying it. so let's just get on with it I'm telling the reason why there's five reasons why or if there's five reasons that I stop making gotcha life scary stories videos for the first reason my my editing on those videos were pretty much like like blurry or look well, not blurry but like too like glitchy like 
wait like if you go to the next picture it stays on the, the former picture for a while and then turns and glitches to the next picture and knowing like when i did those videos it was fun at first but now i'm older i'm 17 now and looking back i was like saying like am i really gonna be like this for the rest of my life like just making scary story gotcha videos i mean heck even people at school are making make, making fun of me like what why are you making gotcha life videos think i'm a complete weirdo but other than that i didn't really like now looking at those videos i i don't really intend to do any more of these But, so, let's just say I lose kind of interest in those videos. Alright, reason two. It kind of seems like a fan fiction to me. You probably won't even get it, but I there's no words to explain this or anything at all. But, I don't know what to, like, how to explain this. But, looking back at the those videos, just feels like fan fiction to me there's no words for me saying how it, how this feeling is it's really hard to explain actually reason three like i don't really hate like regret fully regret on making those videos but i mean like i mean it was really nice for me to start off but like, when I, like, the last video I posted, the first, the la like, the last ever Scary Story Gotcha Life video was the, which one was it? Um, the Cat in the Shopping Bag in 2022, before my summer vacation started. Like, it was literally, no, after that was, like, the final video I did with the gotch life but and i went to narrating the wolf girl and other scary stories i didn't recover on gotcha life only to end up with the trouble chapter two but i didn't get to finish narrating those yet so my bad on that one and after that like i just fully went on doing my own personal stuff like vlogging or like what's going on with me and heck, when I joined in 2022, like, three months after I quit Gotcha Life videos, that's when I went to the Z community. And, so, and then 2023 came along. I wanted to do creepypasta narratings. Like, but... The thing is, like, it's nothing wrong about any of that right now. And then next thing I did was My Little Pony Clot Fix readings. But I don't have no clue what else to be on this channel. I'm confused of right now like what this channel is mainly about. I don't even know what to say. And heck, right now I'm, I'm just now I'm doing like I'm doing childhood stories back in kindergarten with the first two like it's not about the age it's about the inches or the first f-bomb i made as of right now i don't even know what i'm doing with this channel anymore i literally wanted to quit this channel and just focus my, my focus on my other my theme park account i have going on now which i'm posting on those because i'm going to theme parks more often so i'm I literally, like, I literally just wanted, like, to be done with this channel. But I'm not, I'm not sure if I'm ready to quit. And even if I do quit, I'm still intending to leave this channel up for memories and stuff like that. But I intend not to do, probably n not, no more of Gotcha Life videos anymore. And reason for like besides alvin schwartz passed away 
I'm pretty sure if he looked back at my old, at my videos, he probably would have think it's an embarrassment for the for the books or something. I mean, 2021 was really good for for my because I started YouTube and stuff like that. But I mean, I was pretty much getting bullied sometimes. Well, not really bullied, but making fun of. I don't know why I mixed those two. But making fun of at school of me doing gotcha live videos. But when I got to narrations, they would think it was pretty interesting what I did there. So, yeah. I don't know if I'm intending to do any more of these videos. Or if I'm... Or... I don't think... I'm, I don't know if I'm, if I'm going to do any more videos of these. But let's just say that I'm not quitting right now. I'm not quitting this channel. I'm probably going to post more things about my childhood story or creep pastas and bring back cloth figs. I'm trying to bring back the new life series, even though I, I haven't, like, it's been a whole ass year. I, I haven't got to that series yet. But, yeah, that's pretty much it. But, yeah, follow my other, my other account. Because even if I do quit this channel, I'm still not quitting YouTube. You can follow my other account, Theme Park Vlogs. Well, no, Theme Park Zay now, but, you know. So, yeah. Stay, so, yeah, just, um, yeah. Stay, um, stay tuned. I'll probably post more videos of these, but, yeah. And like always, I'm still sick of the same town, the same place, and these same faces. Bye.